Yeah, what's up? So you probably came here to know how Roblo how to make Roblox better. I will only go over like the Roblox client and the Roblox website as a whole. I'm not gonna go on a, on development side of things because most of you all probably aren't developers. Just saying. So um, we are gonna begin with the website, just normal website, nothing else. Uh, I want you to click on the settings section and click on settings. So if you want to play more games, um, you can put the put the online experiences over here. Um, but first, I want to go over the theme. Um, so you know this theme. It's uh, wow, this is very bright. Uh, you want to go to dark theme, and well, it is so much better. Um, if you aren't used to this, don't worry, you will get used to it pretty quickly. It is so much better. Also, I'd recommend you have an email address and a phone number so that you don't get hacked. Um, it's not gonna like do much, just gonna make it easier to verify that th this is in fact you. I also recommend you disable this. Um, it just makes it more funny, so I just I just keep it enabled. Uh, who can message me? No one, because there's a bunch of scams on that section. And yeah, pretty much what you got. Also, I'd recommend you to this. Um, but I have it on everyone, so you all can join me in game whenever you want. Um, also, you can put this on everyone for everyone else's convenience. Um, also, everyone and trade filter. I don't know. I don't trade, so I, I just keep it on non. And also, if you have VIP service, it's gonna make it so much easier to join streamers. So please keep it on everyone. Yeah, that's basically it for settings mostly. Um, so we have settings done. Uh, now we go over to the extension. So um, a big warning. Um, just stick with the ones that are actually good. So Row Pro, better Roblox than Row Gold, and nothing else. Okay, that's a, that's a very big a no. So this, I have no idea what this is, but I will use it. Um, this, I don't know. None of these I've used. A lot of these probably have malware inside of them. So. Just stick with the ones that are trusted, but like the Roblox, Row Gold, and Nero Pro. I went over this in another video, um, so you can watch that later on. Um, so just click on. Um, I'll have these all in the description, so you you all know where to go. And boom, you got every single one. And uh, now, if you refresh, you will have a little bit of a different. Um, thing. Um, you want to click verify here. It's basically just a one click verification thing and boom You have how much you played games here. You have um, uh, if you scroll down You will have favorites and stuff like that You will look you can literally go to the sandbox and just design an outfit without going to uh, different games It's insane. Uh, you can also go to BTR settings and you can just hide ads You can mess around with this until you like it honestly just Make sure you don't like do stupid things. Uh, we can go to Ropro and you can enable some of these, enable none of these. It's your choice. If you like, if you like something, just keep it enabled. If you don't like something, don't keep it enabled. And yeah, it's just essentially just it's essentially just making Roblox a lot better as a as a website. All right, so now that you have a, the website a billion times better and no longer get annoyed by scams, um, you can go over here and you see this section. Um, we are going to go after that section. Now, you may have known that I'd probably talk about this again. It's just super good. I, I'm just going to say it right now. My friend, which has a much better computer than me, got like 200 more FPS. It's absolutely insane. And for first, it might come up with like um with like a smart screen thing that's telling you how hey maybe this is not so safe. But uh, honestly, it's just not really a virus. If you go over here, you can check the code out, and if you see something sus, then comment down below. But I don't believe anyone would say anything. Yeah, it's just really good. It can it can give you like a bunch of tools that you can customized climate and stuff like that it's so good so let's just go install it um again uh i installed it for this video so i have to reset everything 
up so yeah i'm gonna click on this and boom th th this is what it will come up so if you really hate um big companies spying on you then you can disable this um but that will disable a lot more settings um so i'll i usually leave it enabled and if you want to know wh which server you'll you'll join maybe for me i usually keep it enabled for the lulls because sometimes it just pops up with something super random like super far away like I don't know, Singapore would come up some sometimes, and that's pretty funny, because I live in Europe, so I, I don't think that's a really good ping situation over there. Um, you can also show your Discord activity, so if you have, like, a funny Discord client, like, um, Vancord, like I do, so make sure to use Vancord, because it's kind of good. Um, you can also have it on Discord. So, yeah, it's gonna say that this is activity, but honestly, I don't keep this enabled. And this is the reason why is because I don't want it to be enabled. Um, you can also enable this. So, if you are on one, one client, you are playing Roblox and you need an alt, you're gonna go to like the you're gonna go like on Firefox with an alternative account, and now you have two Robloxes. Instead of the one closing and this one opening instead. It's good. I, I really like it. So I usually keep this enabled. Mods. This is where you're gonna spend a long time here. Um, and if you like the order cursor, which I did. Um, you can enable this. And if you want this. I don't know who the fuck will choose this. But yeah, just use this. And it's gonna be great. You can also bring back the old oof sound effect, so you can also get the nostalgic oof instead of eh. If you go over here, you can disable Roblox app, which will disable this, and you can also emulate the old character shots, but I honestly don't really know why you will. Also, you can change the emoji type, but I won't change this because it makes a bunch of games look goofy. Um, you just keep keep it on this okay um let's go to fast flags um so this is where you're gonna have a bunch of more fps instead of this just making roblox better this will give you more fps so i'd recommend uh this is probably taking my refresh rate of my of my display i know flex um i usually keep it like at like a 99999 so i have unlimited fps for your preferred technology, honestly, just keep it at choose by game. But if you like FPS and you want higher frames, just go with Voxel. And if you like uh, better graphics, go with Future. And that's going to make sure every single game will look like um, these. Preferred escape menu. Essentially, this is like the old escape menu. This is like the, um, the one that is like over here. Escape menu, if you saw that one. And this one is like the new one. Um, personally, boom, easy. Use old cat texture. So if you, if you hate the new textures like most of us, you can enable this. It's also going to give you slightly more FPS. Um, uh, if you go down here, rendering mode. Um, if you if you have Vulkan supported, which a lot of you have, but if you don't, um, uh, go with OpenGL. Um, but Essentially, Vulcan is going to give you most FPS from my experience, but every single computer varies from... So, if you if this doesn't work, it's if it instantly crashes your game, go, go with OpenGL, and if even that crashes your game, then you're going to have a really low-power computer, you have to go with this, or this. Uh, personally, Vulcan, just immediately. Also, you can select this to have more... Uh, like the graphics section, so it's instead of 10, it's 21. So, uh, now that we've gone over this section, we can go over to appear appearance. You can go with light, which looks very ugly, and you can go with dark, which looks absolutely cool. Um, this is what will, this is essentially just like the, when Roblox will start up, so let's just say that this is this is basically what the Roblox will look like when it starts up. Um, if you go over here to progress, it's essentially just going to be the progress bar again. If you oh fuck, um, if you go over to Vista, um, you will see this older one, and this is like the fake boyfriend one, the one that went viral the other day. Um, 
like to keep it as fluent because it looks absolutely fucking gorgeous. And when you click install, it's gonna warn you. Um, essentially just gonna say, uh, hey, it once once it's installed, it's installed. You can go here and just click on block strap. I have a bunch. What the fuck am I writing? You know, you're gonna have this as a first result. So essentially, it's just easy. And boom, install. And now you have a better client. And now it's installing. And just like that, you have a better client. Now, if you join like a game, let's let's jo let's join let, let's join slap battles. Why the fuck not? Um, it's gonna show you that hey, this is like a fucking Singapore server or some shit. I don't know why I'm still mentioning Singapore. It can be literally any other location like Poland and stuff. We're gonna wait, and we are connected to United States, so we are free. This is just basically just better Roblox, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, you can share with it with a friend. Um, so yeah, promote this video to more people. Anyways, I hope you liked this video. Um, goodbye.